Hi, my name is Tony K. Silver, and I'm a LinkedIn profiler. But what makes me stand out from the rest? Well, I've been doing this for 14 years, but a real good point about why you should use me is I was trained by a master LinkedIn trainer back in, say, 13, 14 years ago. But also, they connected me to a group of LinkedIn trainers all over the world. And although we are not working for LinkedIn, don't ever put the work term accredited LinkedIn trainer on your profile because they'll close you down. But we work alongside them as a group. We do some beta testing for them, bits and bobs like that, which means I know what's coming up. My network will tell me about the features, but they're beta testing. And if they're any use, or are they just some of these new fangled Microsoft trying to make it look a bit more like Facebook type things? What I can do is also, I know how the algorithm works. I have a company that I'm very, very friendly with who tries and breaks the algorithm every time it changes. And it changes majorly every about every six months. And I spend about a month just going through testing it to death. At the end of that, I get a report, which I will then let my clients know what it is that you should and shouldn't do on LinkedIn. Mm -hmm. And believe me, the LinkedIn's algorithm and all about being reach, 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 there are lots of ways to decrease your reach. So knowing the ones that can increase your reach really could be very valuable. So those are the sort of things I can pass on to people. Yeah, I demystify it. I hold the hands, I take them through the process. Give them that highly engaging top end because you could be the best person in the world. And what you do, mm -hmm. you know, Pop into your profile, your banner, your headshot, your headline, your about section, and just don't do it. Then people aren't going to scroll down and see the rest, and they certainly aren't going to engage with you. So, how's your LinkedIn profile looking these days? Maybe we should talk.